Welcome to another episode of Tinkering Experiment. In this episode, we'll be trying to smooth out our PLA print with some pure citric acid. One of our subscribers asked if we tried pure citric acid, so we've obtained some powder which we will try in this experiment. Let's start. The instruction says we need to use 4 liters of water for this experiment and 2 tablespoons of the powder. But since I don't have 4 liters of water, we'll just adjust accordingly. We'll pour it in and then we'll mix it. Once we are done, we can drop off our print in it. I'll have to use a bamboo skewer to hold the print down. After that, we'll leave it in for a couple days. Maybe the hot water will help in this experiment, but I'm not too sure, so we'll find out. It's been 5 days now, let's take it out and then look at it closer. I'll wash it off first. So far, I haven't noticed any surface smoothness or anything like that. The layers are still the same and I can still feel them. It doesn't look like it worked. We'll compare it to one that wasn't put into citric acid for 5 days. From our first glance at it, they look completely the same. Although I must say the one that we did the experiment on on the left is actually a bit deformed, I believe from the hot water. But other than that, I don't see any smooth surface on the print, and they look completely identical. Well, there we have it. We tried to smooth our PLA print with pure citric acid, and it doesn't work. We'll just have to look into something else. Before I end, I just want to remind everyone about Tinkering U. The platform has a lot of teaching resources on 3D printing and how you can incorporate it into your curriculum. So be sure to check it out. That's the end of our experiment. If you liked our video, please give us a thumbs up and if you did not, then a thumbs down below. Remember to subscribe and comment on what experiments we'd like to see in the future. Thank you for watching. Tinker out.